Welcome to Electronique Technical Tutorials. Electronique is the fastest growing RPA company today, and it gives unlimited attended and unattended bots at a ridiculous price. STA Group has developed a partnership with Electronique and is providing end-to-end -end RPA solutions for our clients. In this video tutorial, we are expecting to share our knowledge among the community and grow it as well. The Electronique architecture will be discussed in this video tutorial. Electronique consists of three modules, orchestrator, bot agent, and studio. The orchestrator. This is the user interface of the orchestrator. In this top bar, you can see the existing days to expire your license. These are the three main modules of the orchestrator, my account, document hub, and analytics or discover bots. Currently, Document Hub is not included in this account. Next, Analytics. Here we can see what are the tasks that can be taken into RPA. This is the part that is related to this account. You can see how many computers are running under this license. Once users upload bots into Orchestrator, it can be seen here. We can run and schedule bots using this function. Here, it will allow us to see who are the registered users under this license. Using this, we can invite users into our orchestrator. Productive analysis. In this tab, we can see users who are available with studio functionality. In this download option, we can download all the latest software in studio and bot agent. In this billing section, we can see how bots are utilized, also remaining pages for the OCR options. Recipes module allows you to download existing bots. Click on this download option and it will download for free. Currently, there are few free bots that are available, but this will grow soon. Account settings, you can change your password in this option. Next, we will learn about the Electronique Bot Agent. In this summary, you can see the features of the bot agent. Under the license tab is your account name and expiration date. Under the settings tab, you have browser settings, command line arguments, proxy, and email related settings. Under this service tab, we can do authentication for Google and Microsoft. It is really easy to authenticate with these applications. For Abby, you can create an Abby account and register here. We can use these features in the studio as well. This will act as a security wallet and you can save all passwords in this module and we can use those values as inputs in Studio. Now we are moving to Electronique Studio, which would be the bot factory to create unlimited bots. In this left-hand panel, you can see all the activities that can be used for the developments. This is the development canvas, and you can drag and drop the functionalities into this. This is about properties of the activity and variables of the selected property. Here, you can see some main functionalities like Excel, Google, database, and many more. We will go through each module in our upcoming tutorials. Using this button, we can upload bot file into Orchestrator. In the comments section, we will leave links that would support this tutorial. Thank you for watching.